This here is Jubal. He's a Mustang that came out of Oklahoma. His story is that uh, he's probably probably gotten out of Oklahoma when he's probably about two, maybe three, and I don't think maybe people were ready to to work with a Mustang. Um, he ended up at a at a pen uh, for slaughter animals up in North Texas, which was transported down to uh, El Paso, Texas, for uh, sale and, and further transported to Mexico, where they kill animals for the European uh, meat market, horse meat market. Uh, I got him about uh, 17 months ago, and when I got him, uh, he, he was he was a pretty pretty skittish animal. He was pretty scared. We had a lot of getting up off his back, off, off his front end, uh, striking out with his hoofs, biting. He bit me in the stomach. <laughs> You know, he's just a little fearful animal. Uh, we had a little disagreement in this pen one day. He tried to climb out of it. He's tried to climb out of the round pen a couple times. But my plan when I first got him about 17 months ago was uh, he was probably going on four, maybe five then. I thought I'd treat him as a two-year-old and get a couple rides on him then, get some ground training underneath him, and then, and then uh, uh, just uh, work with him on the ground for a year and then uh, uh, start him as a three-year-old this year. And I think he's probably coming six. <laughs> So this is Jubal, and that's his story. He's a lot of a changed animal. He's not so spooky. He hasn't bitten me for a while. Um, you see, I've got a hackamore on him here. That's what I'll be riding him in. Um, I think it t takes a lot of stress out of the mouth initially. That's the way he only has to think about me on his back and not somebody in his mouth. He's a pretty stout thing. Let me turn him sideways here. Short backed. Pretty heavy set. He's got these big old feet. Yep, these are the feet he's tried to tried to paw me with initially, but he's turning out to be a little personable guy, and I hope uh, he accepts this training, uh, which would be me treating him like a three-year-old when he's actually coming six, and see if I get a good horse out of him. So I hope you follow along in Jubal's journey here. Thank you, functional horsemanship.